Hi, Dave Gardner, G, uh, mygboconferenceteam.com, and I want to thank you for coming to watch this next video. And as you can see here, uh, we have quite a few things as far as features and benefits that you can actually get out of using GVO Conference. We have a chat, we have browser, presentation, whiteboard, show, uh, so on and so forth. There's a lot of stuff here that we can use. As you can see, there's a picture of me right there as well. So you've got the video chat. You can have live video chat. Now, I'm going to apologize right now. If it looks like there's some delay, it's because I'm actually using the GVO software that allows you to record your actual webinar. Now, it does actually change it to, a, uh, to an AVI file, so it's going to go a little bit slow. The, the audio picks up great, but there is a little bit of, of, of lag. So again, like I'm going to show you, uh, you know, my, my hands are off and um, you know, I'm taking my hands. I, there's a hands-free uh, mode right now that I can actually use it. There's a little button down here that can go back and forth. Notice it says, please click to stop the hands-free conversation. If I click it, my face is going to disappear in just a second. So there it goes. All right? You can still hear me, but there's a button down here called Talk Now. If I hold on to that, I'm going to come back up. Okay, But as soon as I let go of that button, I'm going to disappear again here. But if I want to do it hands-free, if I want to be able to, you know, kind of grab some reports or, you know, be able to put you, you know, put something on there, you know, show you something in the background, a little ID card or, you know, just whatever you're going to show. Maybe it's a product, maybe it's something else, maybe it's a report that you're holding or that you recently read or a book that you're comparing with somebody else. So that's a nice little feature right there, just to be able to remove yourself from the system. If you want to totally get yourself out of the system, I can make my chat room a lot bigger. So just the regular chat. All right, there we go. Popped in, hello there, everyone. And depending on how many people there, they can all start throwing in chat. Now, if I don't want someone to have a chat, what I can actually do is modify that being open. And up here in my room settings, there's areas up here as far as chat. Okay, so if I want to disable the talk now button, disable the text, okay, prevent guests from, uh, guests from using video, disable sharing, okay, so on and so forth. There's a lot of things that uh, you'll be able to control as a moderator. So that's just in the chat. And I can move that back and forth. Let's say I pull up a browser and I want to actually go on the internet. My chat is still here. So all right, it didn't go anywhere. It just moved a little bit, but you still have the chat. There's a couple other functions here. Click clear to clear all the chat messages from the member. So notice it disappeared. I could actually go and look at a history. All right, and that would actually pull up a folder. Um, it's going to scroll here a little bit, but hopefully it won't bother the, the video here. It's flashing down here at the bottom. So I'm going to see that I have a folder. And when you actually store, you're going to store it based on uh, certain dates that it was actually stored on. Now, you actually have a browser function. So what I've done is gone to one of my other websites. It's actually linked. I have a YouTube video in my website called barefootdesigners.com. It's a marketing website of mine. And you can watch your videos. Uh, thank you for coming to my website today. Now, if you're anything like me, and what you can also do is go into live chat. So, again, those are the first couple uh, ideas here. I can start typing in this as well, and your, your clients can look at that right off the bat. So that's the first part of GVO Conference right here.